Ladies and gentlemen, we are back organizing our Monster Gen Islands, and uh, why not? I mean, I'm I'm pretty bored right now, so I was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and release the episode three for this mini series because you guys have been enjoying it, and I'm pretty bored right now. So let's go ahead and get into this. If you guys do enjoy it, make sure you drop a like, subscribe, grab some popcorns. Anyways, it's going to get started. Ladies and gentlemen, here is where we ended off. Let me go ahead and collect my gold. So we went ahead and finished the first island, the second island. We actually finished this one as well, halfway. Not fully um these are just here but soon will be moved so don't worry about them uh moving on we did finish the nature one the previous episode this was pretty pretty nice because we went ahead and separated the nature boost um so that everybody basically gets some gold boost as you guys can see there's one right there so they're separated pretty good um and maybe I think what I'll do is move one right here. The reason why one was right there instead of here was I think because I don't, I'm pretty sure this, these two habitats weren't filled or something. I'm not sure. But anyways, um, I did fill it up with more mythics as you guys can see. And there is one space there. And I think there's another space right here with hamster. Um, the reason for that is because I went ahead and upgraded them. And now I have four of those um, workers available again. And I'll go ahead and of course upgrade a little more. So maybe we can actually upgrade this. But before I do that, what will be smart is heading over here. Tapping on nature and tapping on mythic. So we can go ahead and bring in at least one or two more before upgrading. I feel like that'd be smart to do because once you start upgrading them, you can't move um, any monsters into those habitats. So something you should probably keep in mind. Nature, mythic, we go ahead and move tremor this time, this time, right? So tremor, we're gonna go ahead and move you with the hamster and we can start upgrading that. And there is one more spot available there. So we might as well go ahead and maybe move one. Um, I'll move one for now, but I won't upgrade the habitat. How about that? Because I might need those two other, um, what's it called? Workers for later. I know I need, I need at least one for sure, but you never know. Maybe I'll need two. So anyways, what I was thinking about doing, by the way, is that, okay, so this is going to be my light, right? With that, both of them are going to be light habitats for mythic monsters that are light element. It's going to be nature alone fire of course and this is going to be ma magic this is what we're going to work on today and also water maybe as well i do have a bunch of water monsters so which one should we start off for first magic or water which one do you guys like more um i think we should move and start with magic first because i can already think of so many magic monsters that i have like for example i have um that one magic supporter slash attacker which is amazing right now um the extra turner you guys know what i'm talking about forget her name but um oh amania yes one of my favorites personal favorites uh she is actually in the magic uh elements and it's actually in the vault it's been in the vault ever since i hashed it and ranked it up so i have missed out on a bunch of gold you know what i mean ever since so what we're gonna do is finally go ahead and give her a place to live in today's video so i'm gonna go ahead and start that we do have the boosts already here too too so that's pretty good that's gonna help me out a bit um now i'm pretty sure the habitat should be able to you know actually fit in here if not then we can probably move some things around here and there but in most parts it should actually work so i do have two all right i think this one's a level four if i'm not mistaken can we fit this here cool that is a level four yes indeed all right so we can actually move a bunch but before we actually do that let's also get rid of these other habitats because why not they're in the way now i do have a bunch of uh spots available in, in the monster vault and before i recorded the video of course this was actually yesterday i went ahead and um sold a bunch of common monsters that i don't need uh so i made a bunch of space for today today's video so that's pretty good you know we went ahead and planned it before i started recording this that's good or else i would have had to go to my monster vault you know sold a bunch of random monsters that i didn't need and it would have taken a long time so this may save me a bunch of time this is something you could probably do um so i'm gonna go ahead and sort that and we're gonna head over to here we're gonna bring in another mythic habitat from the 29 that we have place it right in there all right cool now let's see this is what i like you like you just go ahead and remove them and you place in the new ones, you know what I mean? Like you remove the legendary ones, you place the new ones, and it just fits perfectly. We don't gotta do too much because uh, I think the sides of mythic habitats and legendaries are the same, if I'm not mistaken. You guys can correct me in the comments, but I'm pretty sure they're the same. Like, let me see. Yep, they're the same actually. Look, it fits perfectly. And four of them that we just went ahead and moved to our storage, 
we were able to place them in here. Now, of course, if I don't like these little tiles, I can always just go ahead and remove them. But I think it's fine right now. And it's going to take time, you know, removing them. So I think I'll keep it the way it is. Now, what I'm going to do is actually head over here and bring in a bunch of my uh, magic monsters. And of course, the first one we're going to move is this one. Yeah, so my personal favorite. All right. And what other thing we could do is move this spectra because I know this is also a magic element. There we go. So we have Spectra. We give in Spectra a new home. Um, we're going to do magic again. Oh, look at this. And Ring 5 is a bet. Ever since race ended, I've kept it in the vault. Until now. We finally... Oh, look at another one. We got Volcanics. Oh my gosh. We're keeping four of the really good monsters. You know what I mean? In one habitat. And of course, we do have a lot more... I don't know how much we have, but we have a lot. Look at this. Oh my goodness. We have pure panda that's been in the vault ever since Corrupted Era. All right. So we're going to go ahead and give you a home there. And of course, I'll go ahead and upgrade these later on. They're only taking one monster for now. But soon, it'll be filled, uh, filled with at least, you know, four, of course. All right. You, my friend, you're also going right there. We got magic. We're bringing in you. You can come here too. All right, now that that's filled, we need to start moving to this island. And what I'm actually thinking about doing is using one of those other mythic habitats on the other island. So what I'll do with the monsters, move it to the vault, you know what I mean? If they're not magic elements, we move them to the vault and we use a habitat. I'll tell you guys what I, uh, I'll show you guys what I mean in just a second. So look, we just removed that. We bring in, for example, this. This is a level four that Spectra was in. And we basically bring it in here so that we can actually use basically four monsters in one rather than just bringing one from the storage that's only a level one and can only carry one basically so you guys get the point right um i think it should be enough space to put in all of these legendaries in here before it gets filled up so we're gonna go and store that and there's about eight more just for the magic elements and then we have to worry about the water as well uh, for water, I'm. I think Elgata. Yeah, Elgata is for sure in my vault. That's rank five. What other rank fives do I have? Oh, Clutch, I do have rank five. Hydro Rion. Oh my gosh, there's so many water monsters that are in there. Hydro is also metal, right? Or is it only metal? I'm not sure, but it, I know it has both of those elements in his skills. We're gonna go ahead and sort this. And what I'm thinking about doing is maybe. Uh, do we need this? Nah, I don't think we do. None of you guys are magic too, right? No, okay. So what we could do is go to our storage, bring in a mythic habitat like this. We got 26 of them. And I'll go ahead and bring it in right in there. Look at that, sweet. And we should actually move the boost a little to the side. What do you guys think? Whoops, it's not letting me. Oh no, it's stuck in there. The boost is stuck. Are you kidding me? Oh, it's not letting me. I'm literally moving it right now. Look! I'm literally tapping on it and trying to move, but... Oh my gosh, it's just stuck. So I think I'll have to remove this first and then I'll be able to maybe move it. That's so annoying. Oh my gosh. Okay, anyways. Moving on. <laughs> We're gonna bring in more of these mythic habitats. But I'll definitely adjust that boost there. It's way too close. Okay. Bring in another mythi habitat. We have 24 more, thankfully. If we had to build new ones, it would take so long. So it's really nice that I have a bunch of them on my storage. And if you're wondering how I have a bunch, well, thanks Social Point because I bought a bunch of their passes and all those passes have been giving me a bunch of these mythic habitats. Like, look, there's one right here. Do they give any more in the free pass? Uh, so that was about it. Oh, they give you another one right there. So that's two. Do I have any more? So it's two each passes, right? And you know, I've actually bought a bunch of their passes, so... It's just been stacking up every single pass, every single month. Anyways, why am I tapping on Earth when we need magics? Chivaraka? Or Cigarette? Cigarette maybe first. Okay, that's good. We bring in more? We have a bunch more. Yeah. Chivaraka now can come. And that's also an Earth element, but it's fine. Mythic, magic, we bring in this rank three. So we bring in the ones that are like high rank. 
because they produce more gold. So let me bring in all the ones that are ranked up and stuff. Magic, Mythic again, and who should we bring in this time? Ooh, one of my favorites, UV Fusion. You go in with an another Magic, and... Oh no, that's a Legendary. <laughs> Malfeder or Hardy? Maybe Hardy, because that's a Mythic rank 5. So we could do that. We do Magic, Mythic, and... We'll bring in Stockiller. How's that? Oh, I have a spot open there. Uh, do I have any Thunder Monsters that I could actually move there? And... Wait, did you just give me an option to place a monster here? Oh, a Light. Do I have any Light Monsters? Mythics? I think I have Armwell, right? We can bring in Armwell in there, sure. I mean, there's a free spot there. Oh, I have another spot. Do I have any more Mythics that are Light Elements? Mythic... Oh, Unspeakable. That's my only one. Alright, well, then I'll have to upgrade it again, but... Okay, cool. Uh, I don't think I have any Thunder Mythics. Maybe I have, like, Urder or something? No? Okay, never mind. So that's a free habitat, free spot for anybody that I hatch in the future. That's a uh, Thunder Element, of course. But anyways, um, moving back to Magic, we're going to bring in Kloxuko. Kloxuko can be played... Nope. I can't place it anywhere for now. Um, so, what I'll do is I'll go ahead and upgrade this random habitat right here. And of course, I do have one more worker available, so I'll go ahead and use that very soon. But for now, we're going to go ahead and save it so we can actually build more habitats. Um, but anyways, Counter Jr., you need to go in the vault for Warmaster Babari. Look, all these random monsters that I've just went ahead and hashed and placed here. Like, look, this one's a fire element. What the heck is it doing in the water area? Isn't it crazy? So... <laughs> Oh my gosh, um, can I actually place some mythic habitat there? I don't know if I can, but we can probably try. This island can actually carry a bunch of habitats, I can already tell. Oh yeah, look at that. So there's one. And basically all these legendary habitats you see, so that's about four right there. I'm not sure if I can actually place two in here, but we could probably try those. And then we have about four more. I'm not sure if I can uh, put any mythics there, but we can probably try. I don't know why it took me there, but it's fine. Soon all of those will be replaced too, so it doesn't matter. Anyways, what if we store this? I want to see if I can actually place a Mythic Habitat there, so let me go ahead and give her that. Mythic Habitat? I don't think so. I think that's a bigger size than the other one. Oh, wait, maybe not. Maybe that uh, little thing helped me out when I removed it. I think it helped me out. Uh, we could probably test it out on this one, actually. And if I see any gold petals back there, I'll go ahead and not touch them and see if I can actually place any mythic habitats there. So you, my friend, you're going to go in there too. We're going to go back to our storage. We're going to go back to this and bring in this. We have 21 more. And oops, I forgot to place it in the store. All right, how about now? We are about to find out the moment of truth. I don't think it's going to fit, but we can see if it is. No, see, I told you that moving that gold pedal actually uh, give me the option. Oh no, yeah. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. What if what if we just remove this? I don't know if that'll help, but maybe maybe it helps. Oh no. Okay, so we can't actually place any mythics there. Uh, with habitats. Okay. Um. Anyways, <laughs> with the gold boost, yes, we need to store these for now. Or oh no, I should have probably just put them right here. This is also. An option. Yeah, we can just put them right there. Um, but sadly, I can't. Uh, oh, what if I do this? Wait, hold on. What if we stored these, all these gold pavings here? I didn't even know these were here. What have I done to my island in the past? <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and move this. Place it there. Place this cryotin as well. I remember when cryotin was good. Somewhat good. Uh, Cave and Fish used to be one of the best legendaries back then. Oh man, I remember when that monster was in meta. Uh, he was too good. Alright, so we get rid of this gold. We go to storage and bring in one of these mythic habitats. And now I have about 20 more. Oh my gosh. Wait, what the heck is this? Dear Monster Master, we've been notified that you've cancelled your last transaction. Therefore, we have removed the content purchase on it. Wait, what? Wait. Was this the pass? Because I purchased it with a gift card? Or... Wait, hold on. Was it the island? No, it wasn't the island. That is so weird. I wonder what they actually removed. 
my gems. Oh no. My gems went down to 705. I have to contact support. What the heck? It was originally 1200, I believe. Um, you guys can let me know in the comments. I think I'm pretty sure it was 1200. I could actually review the footage because I actually got all this in a video. I reloaded the game in 1705. What? I purchased a gem pack for 50 bucks a couple of days ago. A couple of days ago, I think it was like June 10th or something, I needed it for Tails. And they only removed partial of it, which is so weird because... What? I'm so confused. How? Why would they actually do that? I have the context for it. <laughs> what? Do I still have my cells for Hornbrood? I better have it. I 3,000? Is that the correct amount? Is this 3,000 together? I think it is, yeah. What? <laughs> Yo, I have the context of Ford. Anyways, alright, let's get back to this. Alright, so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go ahead and move all these monsters. Varuna, oh no. Let's get rid of this habitat or else it'll be a pain. Um, so what I can do is actually remove this. This is where, we're re where we were before I had to reload my game. Um, and I had like 21 mythic habitats, of course. We're gonna go ahead and place one right here as close as possible to this one. You don't want to waste any space just like that. And uh, this you can actually move a little more. And maybe we can place another mythic habitat there now. I'm not sure, but we'll find out. Can I actually store this? I wonder what happens if I store this. Oh, never mind. It says it can't be stored right now because there's monsters in it. Makes sense. All right. Uh, it would have been cool if they just like put them all in the vault. Oh man, they, they need to do that. SP. You need to do that. It'd be cool if you could do that. I'm going to store this. We're going to move four more legendaries. Looks like we're almost out of space, which is not good at all. Because we need to um, have a bunch more space for all these other monsters. Let me see. Um, I have four water monsters there. We're going to go on and store that. Bring in another habitat. A level 20. What am I saying a level 20? It's 20 more left. <laughs> Did I just say a level 20? 19 more left now. Okay, this is going to be the 19th one. We bring in right in there. And I know for a fact I actually have some water monsters here. Like for example, Mr. Not Found. We can go ahead and bring in and place it right there. Do I have any more water monsters here? I do have this guy. Not my favorite, but we're going to place it there. And what we could do is go ahead and bring in a bunch of water monsters that are like rank fives and stuff because that'll help me the most with like contributing gold. It's really good. All right, water, Crichton or Elgata. It doesn't matter. I guess we go with Elgata or something. And actually what I'll do is I'll move this guy, put him in the vault for now because he's not going to give me too much gold. Let me bring in Hydro instead. Hydro is busy. Well, sucks for you because I'm going to bring in Snowgross instead. You shouldn't have been busy. Alright. Anyways, can I move these real quick in the vault? I can. Sweet. Four spots available. And I moved in like, what, three monsters from the vault? So, technically we only moved one here. And what I can do is actually store this. Bring in a Mythic Habitat. And I wonder if I could actually place it in this little side right here. I can? Okay, cool. So we're going to go and place it right there. Actually, a little maybe to the side right there because I'll probably fit in some gold boosts here, here and there. Um, I can't move this backwards. Maybe to the side. Actually, it's fine there. We'll, we'll think about it later. We'll fix that later. We'll get rid of that gold having there. All right. Bring in another mythic habitat. Where is it? Okay, we got 17 more. 17 should be enough to cover... Water for sure. Yeah. I can't place anything there. Are you kidding me? <laughs> what if I do this? Hold on. <laughs> and then we go back here. Bring in this mythic habitat. Now it should fit. No? Oh, it's because of this. Okay. Now it should work. For the third time. Third time's a charm. Like, like they say. You know what I mean? Third time is definitely a charm. Look at that. Fit. Okay, cool. Now, what I can do is bring in two more mythics, and then I can actually move these guys over to the vault. So, I can place in one more monster. But anyways, water mythic, we need to bring in seashell guard. 
That's one of them. We can put right in there. And let me move in another monster. Oops. Move this in here. Um, yeah, actually, we can bring in a water. So who shall we bring? Cryotin. Do we have any other mythics? Oh, Siokara. Yes, give me, give me, Siokara. You've been in the vault for so long. And we can move in two more. We should have space available here. Uh, mythic. No, no, no. We can't actually bring in anything because I need another mythic habitat to place. Because those are level ones. Remember, keep that in mind. All right. So we go to our storage. We bring in a habitat just like this. And we bring in the mythic habitat and place it right... Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? No. So wait, maybe I'll be able to place only one more mythic habitat if I'm not mistaken. Because even if I move this over to the side, I won't be able to. Um, so yeah, I can only bring about one more mythic habitat. I can't squeeze in two. Maybe I can squeeze in two, I think. Um, we're about to find out actually. But the thing is, these monsters are taking some space. So here's what I'm thinking about doing. We go here. We sell some of these monsters that I don't need anymore. So you, you for example, you guys are easy to obtain anyway. So it only takes like what a hundred gold or something. <laughs> I'll get rid of you guys. Uh, Jenny, either hand. I don't need Jenny. Get rid of you. Uh, uncommons. We need those for race. Vaporal. What the heck am I doing with a Vaporal? Shanky. You need to get out of here too. <laughs> um. Who else do I not need? This guy maybe. Sure. And I'll go ahead and sell one of my panicans. That's fine. Okay, that should be enough space now to take in all these guys right here into the vault, right? Should be enough space. We got Freedom Fighter. We can bring in this fish. Can I place that fish in there? I can't. That's a fire habitat. Okay, cool. And now we store this. Alright, so that's one of the habitats. And we got, oh my gosh, look at those little baby sea lions. We can actually sell them, yes. <laughs> Why not? They're going to take up space and it's easy to get them anyways during race. I had to do it, I'm sorry. Alright, anyways. Gold having, get away, get out of here. Uh, can I place two mythic habitats? Please, 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 please. I should be able to. Yeah, yeah, th this is huge enough for at least two mythic habitats. And then the last little space I can... Probably fit the temple, the water temple. Wait, maybe we'll be able to. Wait, hold on. Can we place two habitats? Imagine. Imagine. Hold on. We have 14 more mythic habitats here. Oh, sweet. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking about doing. For the temple, we could place it like right here or something. That simple. All right, um, we can move this a little to the side here as close as possible. Uh, but the thing is, actually, hold on. We put that there. We put this right here. And then we can actually place the temples in between, like on the middle or something. Look at that. Beautiful, right? Oh, that is awesome. All right, so we have two of them there. Um, I can't move that to the side there. I can't move this anywhere up there. Um, oof. We need to do a good job with the placements here. Um, you guys are going to get a lot of gold. 80% I see, 20%, 10%. This one's not receiving any. So maybe we can actually bring at least one of the gold boosts right in the middle here. So it, it's actually like helping all these four mythic habitats right here. And then we can, um, we have this other one that's also helping, you know, these guys. I'm not sure about this one. This one's receiving 10%, so it's only these two and these two, of course. Um, another thing we can actually do is bring in more and probably place it in the back right there. So the ones that we stored earlier, um, I wonder where they are. Is it this one? Yep, the water boost right here. Okay, cool. We go ahead and bring it and we'll place one maybe right there. What do you guys think? Or maybe I can place it in between, but the thing is, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think I know what to do. What if we move this habitat here? And we place it right in there. Oh, sweet. Look at that. That looks good. And we go ahead and bring in the last one and place it in the middle, just like the other ones. So look, water boost, we bring it. And we place it right about here. What do you guys think about this? All right, cool. So all these monsters later on will be receiving gold. And speaking of that, we need to bring in some water monsters from here. Drobonauts, you've been in the vault forever. Who else? Um, any other Mythic Ring 5s? Uh, Hydro. Hydro is busy. So we bring in Cryo Crawler. We place Cryo there. And 
We do water. Let me see. Any other rank fives here? No rank fives. Cosmics, mythics. Okay. How about we bring in this mega lobot? Sure. All right. And now we can probably upgrade uh, one of them. If not, uh, what I can do is I can bring in the water beast. Move, move, move. Let's go. Oops. All right. You can. You can't fit there. So we'll just put you right in there. Okay, cool. That looks good, right? So we went ahead and worked on the water island this video. We also worked on the magic one. So they'll be upgrading very soon. And, you know, there'll be tons of space for all of them. Um, and we are out of workers now. So we're, we made lots of progress. Next video will probably be the metal. And this is... There's not going to be any changes to this one because it's just going to be my farms. Um, but this island will probably be for Earth, okay? Uh, if not Earth, we can probably do something different than Earth. Uh, we'll have to find out. And we also have this island to work with as well. So it's a lot of space still available. Isn't that crazy? And this this one, I'm just going to troll around with this one. Or maybe it's going to be my race prep island uh, where I have like a bunch of monsters. Or maybe one of the challenges. Uh, I'm not going to leak anything. Uh, but you guys will probably see it in one of my future videos. Um, what I'm gonna do with the silent. Alright, but anyways guys, that's gonna be pretty much it for today's Monster Gents mini-series episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to drop a like, subscribe. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.